Which of us in our childhood did not want to know what lies there? Over the horizon? Or over the sea? Over the high mountains? We brought puzzles. We wanted to discover great mysteries. But over the years, we did not want to anymore. We were bogged down in concerns, routines, day-to-day -day problems. But some had decided to retain this childish curiosity. Such as Columbus, Magellan, Copernicus, Newton, Einstein. It is them who do not stop, who humanity thanks for their progress. But there is a man who we thank even more. About 6,000 years ago, in this ordinary man, nothing special at all, suddenly came a strange aspiration. He wanted to know who is controlling the universe. Everything that is in our environment, visible, not visible. What is the purpose of creation, of nature, people, what for? This man, who wanted to know everything, was named Adam. He was really stubborn. He did not give up. He was given the answers to all of his questions. He discovered the controlling force of nature. It was known to be wise and great. He discovered the law which has subjected to absolutely everything. He has taught many students, but his greatest student was named Abraham. About him, we will talk about that next.